Hey, all my software deploying sysadmins, it's Lex from PDQ.com. I'm gonna take you through using a heartbeat schedule. Now, heartbeat, what is a heartbeat? Basically, in inventory, our heartbeat, if you go to options, preferences, and you look under network right there, interval in seconds, heartbeat. So the default is 300 seconds, which is five minutes, okay? Basically, what it's gonna go do is ping the machine to make sure it's online. Now what that looks like, if you go in inventory here, and we scroll down, right here, the machine summer, target computer is offline. So right now it's marked as a no. If the next heartbeat schedule that goes around, it comes back on, that's gonna change from a no to a yes. So how does this come into play when it comes to schedules and deployment? Let me show you. Right here, I have built a Chrome schedule, okay? Now my Chrome schedule is set to go every week at Friday at 8 p.m. Fair enough. And it's going to deploy to any machine that has an old version of Chrome. Again, pretty simple to understand. That comes from inventory, nice dynamic schedule. Well, let's say that machine that we were talking about, Summer, was offline at Friday at 8 o'clock when it was supposed to get Chrome. What happens? Well, nothing at this point, but I'm going to show you how to fix that, how to change that. We go into that schedule. We're going to add another trigger. We're going to add what's called the heartbeat trigger. Okay. Now, I'm going to go in and tell that heartbeat trigger to run the Monday following. The first time I want that to run is the Monday following that Friday install. All right. Let that heartbeat take over. And what that's going to do is this. So Friday, 8 o'clock, it's going to coat and try and deploy to all the machines that are online. So it deploys and it catches all those machines but summer, which is offline. Well, let's say I was using the machine summer. I accidentally turned it off when I went home for the weekend. When I come in on Monday and I turn it on, okay, the machine's going to come on, and within 300 seconds, or the default heartbeat setting, it's going to get a ping, and it's going to go, oh, it's online in inventory, and it's going to go from a no to a yes. Once it does that, inventory is going to check with deploy and say, hey, was I supposed to get anything since I was logged on last? Yes, I was supposed to get Chrome, and it will install it as soon as possible, which is generally within a couple of minutes of it coming online, which is a great thing. So... We're going to get Chrome on all those machines and when they come back online. Where this also works is if someone takes a laptop off-site, brings it back on-site, again, that heartbeat's going to pick that up. It's going to get Chrome. Um, some things, little caveats on using heartbeats and heartbeat schedules. Things you don't want to send out on a heartbeat schedule. A reboot. The machine's already off. When it comes on, you probably don't want to shut it off again. I don't know. Maybe you do. But it's something to think about, so... But that's a heartbeat schedule. Again, the big thing to take away from here is the heartbeat schedule is kicked off when a machine goes from an offline state like this to an online state in inventory, and then the rest happens from there. So use it. It's a great way to catch those machines that happen to be turned off or off the network while you're out doing deployments. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm Lex from PDQ.com.